all the athletes from more than 50 countries from around the world are here in the Bahamas for the second annual IAAF World Relays. The Thomas A. Robinson National Stadium is ready for a fast meet and so is Team Bahamas. The athletes are encouraging you to be out and they're ready to show the world why sports is better in the Bahamas. It's better in the Bahamas. The stadium is sold out with spectators coming from all over to witness the fastest teams in the world, including the 2012 Olympic gold medal 4x4 team. Ramon Miller says there's been a buzz about the competition and the Bahamas for weeks now. People being tweeting about it because, you know, I'm on Twitter, everybody being tweeting about coming to the Bahamas and then when they reach, you know, they, the Instagram saying they're in the Bahamas. Despite the weather yesterday, you know, everybody was really excited to come here, you know, we're all staying in Atlantis, you know. Atlanta is like one of the biggest showcase around the world. Everybody talks about it and they have a chance to stay there and, you know, and do a little activity. So it's always a major plus. More than 100 international journalists are here to publicize the relays and the two-day event will be broadcast to millions of viewers in many countries. Youth Sports and Culture Minister Danny Johnson says the Bahamas is ready to put on the best IAAF world relays. When we talk about Team Bahamas, it is not just the athletes on the field. It is from people reach the airport. It is the taxi drivers. It is that our streets should be absolutely spotless and clean. Every single thing that makes up this country is a part of that team. And every single person in this country is a part of this team. Gates open at 3 p.m. tomorrow and you're encouraged to wear aqua. Come on out on Sunday in your yellow and support Team Bahamas. See you at the stadium. For the Tourism Today Network, I'm Nikia DeVoe.